former president John Dramani Mahama, who is urging government to come clean and reveal the Ghanaians, uh, to Ghanaians uh, the state of the economy in a national dialogue. According to him, the economy wouldn't be in its wobbly state if the Kufuadu-led administration turned and listened here to the red flags raised by the opposition NDC, journalists and CSOs across the country. He made this comment during a meeting with the newly elected executives of the Ghana Journalists Association. As part of effort to ensure that the Ghana Journalist Association becomes vibrant and proactive, its executives have begun a series of courtesy calls and engagement with stakeholders in parts of the country. Friday was the turn of former President John Dramani Mahama. Albert Kobina John Four is the president for the GJA. Support and promotion of press freedom is non negotiable. You've been a guest of honor for our GJ Awards when you were the president. This is how important you value the association. As a communication expert, we are here to share with you some of our key visions, some of our commitments so as to get your guidance, advice, and your support in achieving that. We can't do it all alone. And that is why we are calling on you this morning. Former President John Dramani Mahama charged the association to begin a fresh campaign aimed at ensuring that killers of private investigator Ahmed Swali are brought to book, adding the recent harassment of journalists by the national security apparatus is unacceptable. Of course, one of your own paid the ultimate price, uh, Ahmed Swali, and as of now, um, there still doesn't seem to be any movement in apprehending the people who assassinated him in such cold blood. And I think that is something that um, you must not sleep on. You must continue to uh, fight to make sure that whoever were responsible for that murder you know, are brought to, to book. The current state of the media, you know, calls for concern. And um, if you just look at our current performance on the Press Freedom Index, it is very concerning that our performance has been so poor. The former president also took a swipe at government for running the country's economy into a ditch. In circumstances like this of national crisis, what you do is you rally the country together, you know, so that everybody comes on board to support us getting out of the crisis. Even at the time we were raising the red flag about the economy, they say, oh no, the economy is robust, it's robust. You know, if your ship is sinking and ships are passing by and saying, do you have any trouble, can we help you? You say, no, 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 our economy is fine. <laughs> you will sink. <laughs> And that is what has happened. We've come to the reality of the situation. The GJA will be holding its annual award ceremony themed working a path towards Ghana's economy, the role of the media next month.